is a 74 year old man who had nine months previously undergone right common femoral endarterectomy uh, with patch. On follow-up, he had a progressive increase in the velocities, both the origins of the SFA and the Profunda. And because we felt the entire repair was in jeopardy, he was brought back, accessed through the left groin. Uh, you see the aorta itself looked fine, the right LA extent looked fine. Uh, we then crossed the bifurcation fairly easily across the uh, high-grade SFA stenosis. We then exchange out an O3-5 where it allowed us to bring a seven French sheath uh, up and over after anticoagulation. We then recrossed the lesion using an 014 wire. The plan was to buddy a second 014 wire down into the profunda. And that's really uh, what you're seeing at this point is the second wire has been advanced. Uh, essentially, the plan is to, to use drug eluding balloons to treat both the SFA and the profunda origin. The advantage of having a safety wire is that should uh, one or other of these vessels become occluded and that we at least have options of how to actually try and reopen them. So what's been done now is a drug eluding balloon has been brought up. Uh, this was a four by a four millimeter balloon uh, in the SFA extending up into the common femoral artery. Uh, the dwell time for these balloons was at two and a half minutes and this is a paclitaxel eluding balloon. And you can see dramatic improvement uh, with this in the SFA. Plan is now to essentially do the same thing in a profunda, leaving both of these wires. Now the balloon is actually in a profunda orifice. And the balloon has been brought up into place. Second balloon being inflated. Just one more flush with the origin. We then did completion. Uh, I wish I'd actually dilated up the more distal common femoral a little bit more, but certainly achieved the desired goal and we opted to stop at that point. Thank you.